quite something just there. So you're going out in this, Tom. Going out in the no, no. RS <laughs> with the man himself. <laughs> this is a great car, yeah, but it's normally aspirated. So they've had to do this crazy aero thing to make up for the fact that it hasn't got enough power. Yeah. There it goes. I've got a two RS and I absolutely love That's it. the car. It's got a Manti kit on it, it's just That's incredible. Yeah. And I say the exact reason because straight yeah. line you get a bit disappointed in this. No, that's a that's a mega thing. I've been enjoying the podcast very much. You enjoying that? Yeah. There's Neil Clifford. I can see, yes. Legend yeah, some he amazing. He's got some, he's got some fing cars. Yeah. The ST one of these doesn't have rear steering, that does interest me. Yeah. Well, right. obviously not driven one of these. Oh, you can't really see it, but you can hear it. There it is. <laughs> going to be wild because obviously like Tom I don't he's never been in the 3RS this is the first time he's ever been in it we're at Castle Coombe as you will have seen from the introduction and he's going out with Chris Harris in the 992 3RS what a first experience there's GoPros in the car so it'll capture everything yeah I'm buzzing for him that's that's so sick the tire is fantastic yeah.
breezy flat through the fast kink. Mm. In a touring, you can't do that. No. I've driven my yellow car around here. You have to lift down there. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, fair play to them. Yeah, it's a proper a... car. I hope you enjoyed that. Oh, what an experience. <laughs> the list of things you never thought you'd do. <laughs> this is up there. As yeah. impressive to you as it was to me. Yeah, no, it's just, yeah. a, it's just got, it, the chassis is amazing. Yeah. And that, that, at Silverstone, it felt a bit underpowered, obviously. It's mm. so open here. Yeah, it doesn't feel, I don't want to be going much quicker than no. that. Really interesting. Gosh, it's a good thing, isn't it? Yeah. Maybe I should have bought one. <laughs> I've got one coming if you have want you? to borrow it. You can well, borrow it anytime, mate, whenever you enjoy, want. Enjoy, yeah. because it's a weapon. I'm not sure I've got a pen to sign that bloody car with. Have you got one or not? No, but we can. I'll go buy one. I'll go okay. grab one somewhere. Let's we'll see if back. someone's got one. Yeah. The M2 looks good, doesn't it? Oh, it's a beaut. And did you see we did a car while race in it, and it was faster on the roll than the new one. Was it? Yeah. Much faster. Pulled away from it, and that was in the manual versus uh, versus automatic. It's a quick car, isn't it? It is, yeah. When, if you, when you put the power things up, it just goes off the scale. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Holy yeah. shit! Holy shit! <laughs> <laughs> was that fun? <laughs> that was insane. <laughs> what was Tom like as a passenger in that? He was uh, he was very relaxed and composed. Yeah. I think he was just a bit taken aback by how fast it goes around corners, how well it stops. You forget when you're driving the car, you've got two advantages. One, you got a wheel to hold on to, and two. You, you know what's being planned, you know what the next move is. So yeah, when you're yeah, about yeah. to brake, you brace. Yeah. He's getting lobbed about. Yeah. But, um, <laughs> but no, I, th I think he was impressed by the new car. Yeah. Of course, then I said, what do you think? He went, I've got one coming. Obviously, obviously. <laughs> How was that, Tom? <laughs> How was that, Luke? Are you asking me what it was like to go uh, in a car, in a GT3 RS 992 with Chris Harris around Castle Coombe? That was mental. That's what that was. I've been watching Chris since I was early 20s, I think, and always been in awe of his driving skills. Now I've experienced it firsthand, and <laughs> it doesn't disappoint. No. Especially in a, especially in a GT3 RS. Yeah. Uh, couldn't get the back end to kick out at all. No. What an incredible car. Grippy as hell, especially around a windy little circuit like this. Mm. Uh, yeah, yeah, sensational. My new uh, M5 CS, purchased straight from the man himself, Chris Harris. What do you think? I think the paintwork is amazing. Mm -hmm. um, fortunately, it's got a bit of PPF along the front. Chris has just been telling me to protect it from the inevitable stone chips <laughs> of Northern Roads. Very excited to drive it now. It's going to be some. It's going to be a lot of fun. We're going to take these two to our next destination. It's going to be a fun couple of days. It's already been a fun day today. 992 GT3 RS, and now this. Beast. <laughs> that looks sick. They look yeah. so good together. They really do. Yeah, as Tom was saying, we, we've got a nice convoy to the next destination. And oh, Chris was saying just off camera how good this car actually is. He said it's one of the best cars he's owned. Yeah. So. Again, we're, we're just getting a pen to sign it because it's another car that he doesn't want to get rid of for the second time. And Tom's uh, bought the second car that he didn't want to get rid of. Mm -hmm. But yeah, no, look at them together. That looks, that, that's too good. It's got the collection of Chris's regrets. Yeah. <laughs> An M2 in 2016, I loved it. It's the best M car I've driven. <laughs> Part two. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> unbelievable. Perfect. Thank you for buying it, boss. I have no uh, idea that you, I, I just put it on the site, just no, thought, here we go. Yeah. I think you're okay. I think you've done all right there. You've yeah, not, I think so. Because there's people yeah. asking 150 grand for them. Yeah. And I think we've set what is a realistic price. It's mm -hmm. done 12,000 miles. I've used it. Yeah. And it's, what, 30 back from this. It's yeah. about right. Yeah, I think, I think so. been in one of these before? No, never. What's your What's your daily? Oh, I've got to go far. Okay. Yeah, but I've been driving your M2 uh, CS around. It's a thing, isn't it? Oh, it's brilliant. It's Lit Litcho does it. It's not as good as that standard. No, no, no. 
it's, it's, it's such a good car. I'd love to be able to drive it how you can drive it, but <laughs> <laughs> to, to like push the capabilities. It's a, honestly, if he doesn't like that, there's not a car he's going to like. <laughs> I reckon I've driven just about everything. And yeah, that's, yeah, yeah. That's the best car. Really? Wow. Road car, yeah. Oh, thank you again for that lap. That, those laps, that was just... Yeah. <laughs> Have you dialed it all as well to like how you would No, it? I've just... I, it's running full. I, I've not done much. I've moved the diff a little bit to try something and I've just... I've wound it all back. It's Because it's so bumpy, I want it as soft as possible. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Have you seen who you seen who sponsors Camp Corner? No, Sorry, no, Quarry. No. <laughs> Quarry. Oh wow, that's brilliant. Yeah, they'll they'll get deleted, don't we? For fuck's sake, <laughs> screensaver. That, that's for the archive. <laughs> so I've just come back from being out in the 992 3RS with Chris Harris. <laughs> that was mad. They did some onboard filming for me um, with the car and just 
I don't know if I'm still sweating, but I was literally dripping with sweat as soon as I came out. But that car is the most insane thing I've ever been a passenger in and to have gone out in it for the very first time. That's the first time I've ever sat in one and properly kind of been around that car. And just to go in it with Chris Harris, to be able to drive it properly like that is just surreal. So I can't thank him enough for taking us out. Tom got to experience it this morning and I've just experienced it now. And yeah, like braking, you can brake like this close to the corner, which is just wild and foot flat all the way down. <sighs> just, yeah, yeah, I'm speechless. This is wild. So first off, Tom, what the f has just what, happened today? What's happened today? <laughs> and you even went out on the speedster with Ed, love it. Spent a whole day with a bunch of really nice people from yeah. the collecting cars. Um, oh, what uh, a great, great group of guys! Uh, yeah, really, yeah. really lovely guys. Yeah, and uh, with with a really cool look of, of rare <laughs> cars. <laughs> yeah. yeah, as you can see behind, like just yeah. this is an Alpha Holics. Yeah, Alpha. Uh, you got a 993 Turbo GTS. Yeah, Yaris best car ever made. Best car. Yeah, the um, 99. Two. There's a 911 RS, a 964 generation on the other side there, a speedster, touring, touring. more stuff down there. there I was, think it's an M, is it an M3? There's an M3, yeah. yeah. Like there's, there's so much here and they've all been out on track mm -hmm. and I don't know about the track lap that you did but what cars were on it because I had the, I had the Alphaholics Oh, was there with me? With, yeah, yeah. I think when we were out, at least as far as I could tell, it was only us. But oh, I don't really? know. Yeah, well, I didn't see another car, but that was with Chris yeah, yeah. Harris driving a. Uh, so nothing was catching us. Oh, yeah, that's no. For sure. yeah. Especially in that. Mm. You'll see from our faces in the video. Well, mm. if you can see them, because we're like this constantly. Mm. But yeah, this is, yeah. this is mad. And what a view we've got here. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.